for your safety. Please. <laughs> I've never been honest with myself. Faked my way through most of the world. What the hell? And he just oh, looked at work. me like I'm insane. Said he never met somebody else that feels the same. But I see it all. You and me. And I don't wanna fall down on my knees. So you. Okay, I'm at the Google Tokyo office in Shibuya. I came here with Katie and I'm just sitting at the cafe that's upstairs. I feel like I'm always being loud here because everyone's so quiet and I'm just more self-conscious of like the space that I physically take up like with my volume and just area around me. I don't know if it's that like Alex was always on me about my spatial awareness and I feel like here I don't know, I always have to be like careful about being disrespectful uh, Yesterday I played volleyball with Quinn and I think I didn't have as much fun as I wanted to but I think that's okay but I think the situation was just that like I couldn't speak any Japanese and not many people there spoke English but the team that we ended up getting put on, it was just hard because I couldn't communicate with them. And I felt partially that they were like making me sit out more because, I don't know, maybe they like perceived that, or I just perceived that they felt like I couldn't do as much as everyone else. Maybe because I'm a girl, maybe because I don't look athletic or whatever, but yeah, I just, I like, can't help but not give people the benefit of the doubt. Like maybe they were doing it with some good reason. I just like had no idea what it was because I couldn't communicate with them. Yeah, I just like can't force myself to think positively. So I always just think the worst. <laughs> Even regardless of that, I still tried to have like a good attitude and I still wanted to play and have fun. I just think like I started off really strong, just like being in my own whatever not really caring so much and then it just kind of went downhill as i got tired i was just like a little bit confused and i think anytime i'm in a state where i don't really know what's going on i just feel very bad um like i didn't really understand the rotations we were doing it just didn't seem like it really matched what we were doing in the states so i was kind of confused but yeah i think i just got really tired just because i've been exhausted for the last couple of days and then I was like, oh, Quinn's not having a good time because he thinks that I'm not having a good time. And I know that I'm not responsible for him having a good time or not. And then, I don't know, part of me also started to think like, oh, I could have been playing better. But honestly, I think I was playing fine. And then this morning I like woke up and I was like, okay, I'm gonna give myself this amount of time to think about it. And then once this is done, I'm gonna be done thinking about it. And it's hard to do that <laughs> for me. I don't know. I'm gonna start thinking about it after I record this video, but yeah after the game too or after the open gym i was just like talking to quinn about it or how he thought it went and he was like oh i had a lot of fun and i was like i don't know mad at myself that i couldn't read him so i was like oh was he having fun because it didn't really seem like in the moment he was having fun um but i think he was just having fun playing like if he was playing he was having fun and that's like totally different than how i am and i know like i think like a lot of people are like, like if they're playing they're having fun even if their face doesn't show it because i think they're just so focused on playing but i'm definitely not like that so i think it's hard sometimes to like see things from the other perspective but yeah i i'm really glad we went and i felt like i had a good attitude and i felt good about myself being like confident 
um from the beginning i just think i need to learn how to sustain that and like be okay with whatever comes my way yeah i think it was just this year's hard because the language barrier but yeah now i'm just gonna work a little bit and then meet up with katie after she's done with her meetings and probably just explore the office i think things are good and i just need to not dwell so much or worry about stuff that already happened because i can't change anything yeah i just maybe next time i don't know what should i do next time <laughs> a part of me was like maybe next time my priority should just be to make sure quinn is having a good time and like if he wants me to give him tips or whatever i can try i maybe should just like realize that i don't know what's happening and that state or feeling maybe i should just realize that that's happening and then try to be okay with it and try to make the most out of it maybe i could have done a better job doing that okay i'm gonna go edit my vlogs now because i'm so behind <laughs> okay last thought sometimes i'm like does volleyball really make me happy or do I, am I really having fun playing volleyball? <sighs> Should I just stop? <laughs> I don't think so. I think it's just hard to be in a good mental state when it comes to team sports and playing with strangers. But yeah, people are just hard. Sports are just hard. And that's okay. I'll just figure it out eventually. But it's fine. Um, okay, goodbye. I'm only gonna take Someone over